let's just say 100% of the people that live in this nation don't want somebody else coming into their nation. If 100% of people in a country believe that it's acceptable to take away the right to life for, say, Jewish people, do you think then keeping them from doing so would be a violation of their freedoms, or are you simply protecting the freedom of the Jewish people? What, is it, what does Jews have to do with this? It's a simple analogy. Just because a democracy wants to take the rights away from a minority group does not mean that you're removing freedom from the majority when you deny them from doing so. A democracy is founded upon majority rule with minority protections, and one of those protections involve basic human freedoms. In this case, we're talking about the right to immigrate. Even if we live in a democracy where the majority of people want to take that freedom away, I don't give a shit. I assume the majority of the people in Saudi Arabia think that gay people deserve the death penalty. I continue to not give a shit. Democracy isn't the be-all, end-all. If that was the case, how could we condemn Nazi Germany for committing to the Holocaust when they were genuinely anti-Semitic? It's silly. Just because a country wants to do something doesn't mean that thing is good or that you're an authoritarian for keeping them from doing so.